How's it going guys? I'm back. I've been getting a lot of people requesting that I make a video on what I would do if I were from a different state with a valid driver's license and if I were to get stopped by a cop, what I would do if he were to allege that my license was not valid since it's not from California. And he would then proceed to give me a citation and have me wait for somebody to drive the car or just take my license and tow the car. Well, what I would do is I would go back to my state and get a copy from the Department of Motor Vehicles that I have a valid driver's license, and then I would come back to California or somehow get that information right now ahead of time. If it hasn't happened to me and I'm in my state and I'm planning on visiting California, I would go ahead and get a copy of that just in case. It sounds paranoid, but it's the least expensive. And then go visit California, at least with a copy somewhere you know at home not on not in the car because if they tow the car then it's gone as well but um i would file then a motion to dismiss along with exhibit a showing that i i have a valid driver's license or it was valid and the cop either took it or i still have it the reason why is because in the ca.gov motor vehicles in the definitions it says number 310 driver's license is a valid license to drive the type of motor vehicle or combination of vehicles for which a person is licensed under this code or by a foreign jurisdiction so you want to ask yourself what's a foreign jurisdiction and number 325 in the definitions foreign jurisdiction is any other state the rest doesn't really matter but it says it right there a foreign jurisdiction is any other state so I'm in another state therefore I have a valid driver's license. Now if my license was suspended and I'm from Texas or Arkansas or Tennessee, of course it's not valid, therefore that argument is out the window. But if it's a valid driver's license and it's obviously from a foreign jurisdiction, I would file a motion to dismiss since the officer was acting under color of law, had no authority to do so, and he did so maliciously. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was short, but you know, it was a lot of people asking the same thing in a different way. Thanks for watching, guys.